new construction coming to the Las Vegas Valley in 2022. And that's what I'm talking about today. So let's roll. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today I want to talk about all the new construction that will be coming to the Las Vegas this year in 2022. They're all coming soon and they are all taking interest lists. And I also have a couple animals with me. What's a video without an animal? You guys haven't met Ruby. She's shy, but she's in here with me. And then of course, we got an Aussie sitting next to me. So if you hear panting and groaning and whatever, that's Mr. Aussie boy. He's right here next to me as well. <laughs> so let's get started. Okay. So when you buy new construction, there's a couple of things you need to know, especially here in the Las Vegas Valley. Sure, you can go look at the homes, but if you do want a real estate agent to represent you, you need to make sure that the real estate agent is with you on the very first visit. Otherwise, we will not be able to represent you. And I've done numerous videos on why it's important to have a real estate agent represent you in a new construction build. There's a lot of things that can go wrong. There's a lot of hands involved buying new construction and it's important to have your own real estate agent represent you because the builder's agent represents the seller. Another thing to consider is buying in the beginning of the phases and that's why I like doing these videos to let you know which new communities are coming soon. That way you can be the first ones to buy in the beginning of the community. And one reason it's important is that you will gain equity by the time that community is completed if you buy within the first couple of phases because it may take a year or two for that community to finish so by then by the time it's finished you will have gained a lot of equity in your home so that's why i like going over these videos so that you're aware of any new construction that's coming to the las vegas valley which could be north las vegas Las Vegas, Summerlin, Henderson areas. Another side note that I always like to bring up is property taxes for new construction is typically around 1% of total purchase price, meaning you have your base price, you have your lot premiums and any upgrades that you select. That total price will be approximately, could be less, 1%. Typically, um, new construction property taxes is at least two times more than resale homes. So FYI on that. So let's get started. We're gonna start of course in the Summerlin area. There's a new village cropping up in Summerlin called Kestrel Village. It's right off of the 215 and Lake Mead, just south of Reverence. They're gonna have right now, they have two new communities cropping up. Um, I don't know what other communities will be in this village, However, I do know of two. And the first one's called Crested Canyon by Taylor Morrison. These homes are very similar to the homes over at Cascades in the Red Point Square Village, where there will be either two or three story homes. They have six different floor plans to choose from. So you have the Acacia, the Beach, and the Cedar, which are two story homes. And then you could make those also into a third story where it adds additional loft space and half bath and balcony, which would be the Acacia Plus, the Beach Plus, and the Cedar Plus. So um, the square foot range is between 1649 to 2242 with three to four bedrooms and two and a half baths and two car garages. And the pricing is going to be starting in the low 500s and currently they are taking pre-sales right now and I think they've already sold a few lots already. I mean, yeah, if you wanna see what the models look like, you just go over to Cascades at the Red Point Square Village by Taylor Morrison and you can see what the model homes look like. So with this one, they are for sure taking pre-sales and not just interest lists. If you're interested in this community, get a hold of me, we'll go down, meet at Cascades, register you so you can get uh, buy a home over in there. 
And the next one in the Kestrel Village is called Falcon Crest by Woodside Homes. They're going to be all single story homes and that's all I know. They haven't disclosed anything else about this community, what the pricing is and what the models are going to look like. And they're not even taking interest lists because I can't even find it anywhere. But it's coming soon. Um, Falcon Crest by Woodside Homes. And did you ever watch the TV show back in the 80s called Falcon Crest? <laughs> I think I did. Now I watch Dynasty and Knott's Landing. I love Knott's Landing. <laughs> now we're gonna go into Sky Canyon and there will be two brand new Toll Brothers communities in Sky Canyon, kind of similar to the one uh, Mott Rose collection and the Vista Rosa collection. However, both of these two new collections will be two-story homes. And the first collection is called the Paloma Collection and this will be in a brand new gated community, again, in Sky Canyon. Um, and these home designs will offer flexible living spaces with up to five bedrooms, a loft, um, open living areas, and starting prices in the low 500s. This will be a gated community and will have a community pool. And you will also have access to all the Sky Canyon amenities. They have not yet released the specific floor plans that will be offered in this community, but they are taking interest lists now. So if you're interested in this community, let me know so I can register you. The next collection is the Valera collection, and this will also be in a gated community with large home sites and spacious luxury two-story designs with up to six bedrooms, multi-gen option, and three-car garage starting in the low 600s. Um, I, I think the largest home goes up to 3,600 square feet. There will be also a community pool in this one as well. So I'm not sure if these two communities will be joined and share the same community pool like over there with the Mont Rose and the Vista Rosa, um, but it seems like when I looked on the maps that they were pretty much in the same neighborhood. I'm surprised they didn't offer single story homes in this community, it's just all two story homes and they seem to be a lot larger. Again, the floor plans have yet to be released in this community, but they are forming interest lists right now. Now, when you do buy Toll Brothers, you gotta realize that Toll Brothers is one of the only builders that takes a lot longer to build the home compared to other builders. Typically now, Toll Brothers is saying 12 months, 14 months, and up to 16 months. So be prepared if you do start buying in this community, you probably won't be able to move in until next year. Now we're gonna go into the Southwest and our first community is going to be Del Mar by Pulte Homes and Del Mar by Pulte Homes will be located in the southwest location in Highlands Ranch in the 89141 zip code. There will be four two-story designs with four to six bedrooms, two and a half to four and a half bathrooms, two to three car garages, available rooftop decks and guest suites provide flexibility for entertaining. So you'll have the Calico, the Delano, the Egan, and the White Plain collection. Um, I'm not gonna go into detail as to how many bedrooms each of these have. I've posted a link down in the description below to a blog post I created with more detail about all of these new communities. So then we have Quinn Canyon by American West Homes, and Quinn Canyon will be located off of South Decatur and West Powell Road, also in the 89141 zip code. There will also be four two-story home designs with four to five bedrooms, two to three and a half bathrooms, and two car garages. And then you have the Jupiter, the Mesquite, the Palo Verde, and the Pinion. Um, again, I'm not gonna go into detail about how big each of these homes are. And if you are not aware of Pulte Homes, bought American Homes a few years back. So sometimes it's interchangeable and you get confused, okay, is this American West or is this Pulte? But these are two new communities, Pulte, which is the Del Mar, and then the Quinn Canyon by American West in the 89141 zip code. Then you have the Cordora, which will be located off of West Windmill Road and South Buffalo Drive in the 89113 zip code. And these floor plans are the exact same floor ones as the uh, Quinn Canyon by American West. So that's why I said it's interchangeable because this is says by Pulte and Quinn Canyon says American West. So it's kind of interesting, little par different parts of the valley, they 
change the names. I don't know why they just don't make it either all Pulte Homes or all American West. But typically American West is usually a lower end than a Pulte Home. So they're gonna also have the Jupiter, the Mesquite, the Palo Verde and the Pinion as well. Four different two-story home designs. Prices have yet to be released and they are forming interest lists right now. Next, we're gonna go into the Spring Valley area. And to me, really, the Spring Valley is the southwest part of town, but they just call it Spring Valley. And our first new home community is gonna be Falls at Jade by DR Horton. This community will be located in between West Hacienda and Diablo in the 89113 zip code. Um, these homes range between 2433 square feet to 2988 square feet, offering four to five bedrooms, two and a half to three bathrooms, and a two-car garage. Um, they'll have three different two-story floor plans to choose from. And again, they have yet to release the price, but they are forming interest lists right now. The next community in Spring Valley is called Desert Pearl by Taylor Morrison. Desert Pearl will be a vibrant community of all single-story homes in Spring Valley. Located off of Peace Way and South Giuliano Road in the 89147 zip code. These homes will range between 2050 to 2756 square feet, offering three to four bedrooms, two to three bathrooms, and two to three car garages. And they will have four different single story floor plans. You'll have the hydrangea, the iris, the orchard, and the rose. And I've noticed that Taylor Morrison single story homes are named after flowers, just like over there in uh, Savannah by Taylor Morrison in the Red Point Village. They are named after flowers as well. You have the lilac, the honeysuckle, the sunflower, and a few others. So that's kind of interesting that the single story homes by Taylor Morrison are named after flowers. Uh, again, prices have yet to be released and they are forming interest lists right now. I can only find one new home community in Henderson, and this one is called Amiata Collection by Toll Brothers at Inspirata. Amiata is a luxury community of stunning townhomes, um, designs with rooftop deck options and private community pool starting in the upper 400s. And this reminds me of Cordillera up in the Red Point Square Village, these townhomes. They're different floor plans, but the concept is the same where they're all three-story townhomes with an option of a rooftop deck. The townhomes range between 1803 square feet to 2154 square feet, which will offer three to four bedrooms, two baths, two and a half baths, and two car garages. And again, as I mentioned earlier, they are all three-story homes. And the last community is on the east side, and it's Nottingham Crossing by Storybook Homes. It's located at the intersection of Hamilton Avenue and Dodge Street, just off of Boulder Highway in the 89122 zip code. And it's just, it's an upcoming community north of Henderson. There'll be four two-story floor plans to choose from. You have the Forester, the Nottingham, the Archer, and the Yorkshire, ranging between 1430 square feet to 1645 square feet with three to four bedrooms, two and a half baths, and one to two car garages. Prices have yet to be released in this community and they are now forming interest lists. That wraps up all the new construction that are coming in the Las Vegas Valley for 2022. Now, of course, as the year progresses, there could be more new home construction communities coming soon. However, this is all that I can find right now, which is by the time you watch this video, January, February. So, I can't stress enough the importance of using your own real estate agent to represent you when you buy a new construction home. We are free of charge. We don't charge you anything. The sellers pay for our commission. We are free of free. Okay. It's important when you buy new construction that on your very first visit, you bring your buyer's agent with you. And after that, if you want to visit as many times as you want, go for it. But Last year alone, I sold over 20 new home sales and I have seven under contract for this year. So I'm quite experienced selling new homes in the Las Vegas Valley. I've sold almost all the builders, um, so I know what to expect. There's just a lot of moving pieces when you buy new construction. It's not as simple as just going, talking to the sales rep and making an offer or 
any of that. Stay tuned, I will be posting a video shortly on the pros and cons of buying new construction. But in the meantime, if you are thinking about buying a new construction home here in the Las Vegas Valley, you can always give me a call at 702-370-5112 or I've posted a link to a buyer form down in the description below. As always, you know what to do, right? Hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, share with a friend and smash that subscribe button because I like to cover a lot about Las Vegas, Las Vegas neighborhoods, Las Vegas new construction, and of course, the Las Vegas real estate market. Thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to see you guys on the next one.